Identification of T-cell receptor specificity using MHC peptide tetramers. For many years, the ability to identify antigen-specific T-cells directly through their receptor specificity eluded immunologists. Foreign antigen could not be used directly to identify T-cells since, unlike B-cells, they do not recognize antigen alone, but rather the complexes of peptide fragments of antigen bound to self-MHC molecules. Moreover, the affinity of interaction between the T-cell receptor and the MHC peptide complex was in practice so low that attempts to label T-cells with their specific MHC peptide complexes routinely failed. The breakthrough in labeling antigen-specific T-cells came with the idea of making multimers of the MHC peptide complex so as to increase the avidity of the interaction. Peptides can be biotinylated using the bacterial enzyme BIRA, which recognizes a specific amino acid sequence. Recombinant MHC molecules containing this target sequence are used to make MHC peptide complexes, which are then biotinylated. Avidin, or the bacterial counterpart streptavidin, contains four sites that bind biotin with extremely high affinity. Mixing the biotinylated MHC peptide complex with avidin or streptavidin results in the formation of an MHC peptide tetramer. Four specific MHC peptide complexes bound to a single molecule of streptavidin. Routinely, the streptavidin moiety is labeled with a fluorochrome to allow detection of those T cells capable of binding the MHC peptide tetramer. And that's identification of T cell receptor specificity using MHC peptide tetramers.